Hello everyone, welcome to the WPAKA channel. In this video, we will be reviewing internal link juicer plugin, its features, pricing plans and finally we will also recommend how you can decide if this plugin is right for you. So let's get started. Do you want to build an SEO friendly site structure? Well, internal link is one of the best SEO practices to do that. Internal links play a huge role in boosting your rankings and user experience. But as your site expands, it becomes very difficult to manage your internal link strategy. And that's where Internal Link Juicer, a popular internal linking plugin for WordPress can help. We have also published a detailed article on our website. Do check out the link in the description box below. Now let's take a quick look at some of the features that Internal Link Juicer has to offer. With this plugin, you can associate keywords with a piece of content in the editor. The most important feature which I liked is the insert gaps between keywords option that allows you to specify the number of words between your keyword phrase. I have to say, I haven't come across this feature in the other interlinking plugins. An option to set up your link count can be found in the content tab and would help you control link frequencies. With this feature, you can limit the maximum number of links built or allow multiple linking of the same destination URL from the same content. You can find the blacklist setting in the settings section of internal link user under the content tab. With the blacklist feature, a post won't display auto-generated internal links. And with the whitelist feature, you can have a control over the posts and page types that you always want to be linked to. The input field shows a list of all the available post types and pages. You can select the type you want to allow linking for. With this feature, you can identify the page or post that have too few or too many outbound or inbound links. The statistics dashboard gives you a quick overview of your entire website's internal linking quality. You can also sort and filter to get information about the links whenever you click on the corresponding anchor text. With this setting, you can define the order of the configured keywords you want to use for linking. This will give you more control over whether or not to link long or short phrases. This setting can be found under the content tab below the whitelist feature. Now is the time to answer the most important question. Is internal link juicer plugin right for you? Well, if you want to automatically insert links in your content and have full control over linking pages, then you really should go for this plugin. The plugin's keyword panel in the post editor guarantees an efficient and easy workflow. It also ensures natural linking behavior by allowing you to create internal links using a diverse range of keywords. That's all from our end. Thank you for watching it. Do tell us in the comment box below about your experience with the plugin. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more tutorials and reviews.